What's going on, y'all? Today we got another The Walking Dead Dead City episode. Last episode, we seen Negan and the Crow had actually had a reunion. But actually, in the beginning of the episode, we got to see that awesome flashback between Simon. They brought him back, Trevor. But now it was just cool seeing, you know, Negan, OG Negan, you know, his uh, savior days with Simon. And we got to see Lucille again. That was exquisite. That was excellent. And we got to see actually the Croat, and we seen the story that Negan was talking about, you know, with the the kid wanderer that uh, was just wandering and came across, and I, I guess Croat came across her, and he unfortunately, you know, tortured the little girl, like, and she didn't make it, you know what I'm saying, which was extremely just crazy, and I think that's you know we needed that to just to see that right to get a better understanding. Um, on how insane this dude actually was, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I wouldn't say we necessarily needed to see it, but it, it was interesting to get a better understanding on how the Croat is and how giddy and skippy he was, like chasing Negan, right? And after all that, right, the ne Negan actually wound up saving the marshal that was in the Croat's clutches. And after after he saved the marshal, the marshal still tried to hold him at gunpoint. Article 83, you know, I'm like, boy, like after all of that, like, come on, man. Like, that's why I would say I would have never expected Negan to save him. But, you know, trying to be a changed man. Like, you just got to stick on the, I don't know, you just, you should have just said fuck the Marshall. Point blank period, right? Still no Herschel. You know what I'm saying? So, I'm guessing this episode we're going to get Herschel or possibly the finale, which is episode six. We'll possibly see Herschel again, right? I don't think he's going, I don't think he's um dead, right? There's no way, right? I would be super surprised if he's actually dead. But uh, let's go ahead and hop into this next episode. And oh yeah, Jenny, uh, Jenny, Jenny, right? Um, Maggie had her dinosaur or something like that. She almost burnt it, but she wound up not burning it, right? Uh, but I think that was like a couple episodes ago. I'm tripping. Um, I don't think they have came, came in contact with Jenny unless I'm tripping. But let's go ahead and hop into this episode, man. I'm, I'm, ta I'm talking too much. It's Maggie and the gang in the sewers. Hot boxing like dead people. What is Amaya this looking is at? Why is uh, Tommaso's uh, uh, light red? Everybody else got a regular white light. And the zombies aren't fully dead down here. You gotta watch out. Is this Negan? Yeah, it's Negan with the Marshal. He's still trying to hold this man at gunpoint. Why would Negan pull out his knife? Was he just trying to go kill some walkers for fun? That's what I'm assuming. Yo. What is Jenny doing? Man, She's just trying to escape you. and run away. Oh wow, state. the marshals from the for, from the Bronx work for folks. work from where the state. Scooping up the I'll be forgetting that Negan was a gym teacher. Bro, y'all about to get surrounded by these walkers because this man is over here limping and shit. If I was Negan, I'd be like, bro, you got to pick up the pace. I'm out. <laughs> All right, they made it in somewhere. But it looked like somebody else could have been in here because the way that that door was made, it looked like it was uh kind of boarded up. Could be wrong, could be empty, but I feel like somebody is in here. Okay, yeah, it's some creepy doll shit. Fuck. Might turn the corner and see some see Chucky or some yeah. shit. What type of sick, disgusting, stinky place is that? Oh, we're back to uh, Amaya, Maggie, Jenny, and uh, Tommaso. I don't know if those are oxygen. I don't know if that's oxygen. Yeah, Maggie, she's suspect of the of those tanks. Maybe it is. Maybe oxygen. I don't know. Jenny's inhaling it. Uh, Maggie thinks Tommaso. Maggie thinks Tommaso is a is a rat. She thinks she thinks Tommaso is a rat. I thought Maggie was suspecting Negan in her head, but nah, she's suspecting Tommaso. Man's had the oxygen tanks in his pack the whole time. Tommaso is a rat. That is cringe as fuck. I wouldn't, I wouldn't even have trusted them tanks. That's what I said. I'll rip them tanks with suspect. And now this nigga's gonna just get pissed and be salty and be mad because he's a rat. Bro, grab the gun. This nigga trying to give you all these silly ass looks. Bro, we do not have time for this. We in the fucking apocalypse. The fuck are you looking at? Bro, I would have been holding tight on my gun or my knife or whatever, nigga. Not playing them type of games in the fucking apocalypse. The fuck's wrong with you? What is that on the ground? I have no idea. Is that a possum? What type of room? Is this a torture room? What the fuck going on? Marshall's putting something together in his head. Something with his family and this victim we see as in front of us. No, I don't think that was a self-deletion. I think that was somebody hit him in the head. Negan used the zombie to, uh... Negan used the walker to escape. I probably would have kicked him in his shit and took the nail gun. Is the marshal, does he, does he have a fucking fever? Or is he just exhausted? Negan is a good man, bro, overall, bro. Because I would have left this man right here on the fucking steps. Fuck him. Look at Tommaso with his goofy ass. So essentially what Tommaso has done overall, he has led 
I don't think we should be taking a break right here. Motherfuckers is still uh, not all the way dead. But what this man Tommaso has done, he has led people he's called called his comrades into death, essentially. Maggie's losing oxygen. She's about to faint. Oh my gosh, bro. We seeing all the fucked up shit, bro. It's hard to trust anything Tommaso's been saying or what he even saying right now. It's like Tommaso, he wants to do the right thing, but in his own way, I guess. Is Jenny offering Amaya some food? Is that what that is? As I say, walkers are not dead over here, bro. He gave up hideouts to save his lover. You can see Tommaso, he wants to do the right thing, but it's just the way you went about it was morally fucked up. Please don't let Amaya get bit right here. That'd be the corniest shit. And then Tommaso trips, of course. Somebody's probably gonna get bit. Somebody's getting bit with all these people getting grabbed. This look like a telltale uh, decision right now. Oh, is Amaya dead? Yeah, Amaya's dead. I think Tommaso got bit. If he, yeah, once he notices Amaya being dead, she, he's gonna lose it. Oh, he got bit in the neck. Oh, he's done with. Yep, Amaya and Tommaso are done. Yep, Amaya got packed, and so did Tommaso by the zombies. I would have thought that all these zombies weren't dead, though. All these pile of zombies. Man, I would have been so suspect of that shit. This is the Barazzi. It's actually the Croat himself. Is he mad because he couldn't, like, counter Negan or some shit? Where did Croat just walk into a fucking talent show area? Well, it seems like the Croat doesn't uh, run, run things down here. So does the Croat have a boss? So this must be the Croat's boss? So the main objective is to recruit Negan and it looks like the Croat's boss is someone he likes or something? I'm not sure. I don't get their relationship, honestly. Yeah, Maggie, if she doesn't get any oxygen, she's gonna pass the fuck out. She should have took the tank that Tomas, uh, Tomas had back to the Marshall and Negan. The most annoying duo ever to me. You got a perfect palette back there for him. This man's brother, his name was Joel. Ah, uh, his brother attacked his mother. So high. so high he didn't know what he was doing, so your brother was a drug addict. Yeah, there's most definitely shades of gray in life in general. Not everything is black and white. It looked like Negan was about to cry for a second. Maggie need to get some oxygen in her lungs. She is bugging. I know you want to soldier it out, but at this point, we can see that the oxygen was actually valid, so you need to get some oxygen in your lungs, girl. Now, Negan, or not Negan, Maggie fell down and woke up some walkers. I like the Jenny and uh, Maggie duo way more than the Marshall and Negan duo, I'll say that. Why would she tell Jenny to go? Maggie, where is your knife? Oh, gosh. Ugh, what type of walker is that? Ugh. The biggest walker ever. This thing has like four heads. Why would she tell Jenny to go, though? I would imagine Jenny has some experience killing walkers, right? Especially she made it all the way from the bricks all the way to where Negan and Maggie are. Now the issue is you don't know where Jenny went. That's what I'm saying. Telling her to go, 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 go was just kind of silly to me. Is this a flashback of Jenny's? Yeah, this is a flashback right now because she doesn't have the mask on. What is that she's looking at? I'm confused. We're kind of getting this present thing of Jenny and then this flashback of Jenny. I'm, I'm confused. Okay, the fact that Maggie's surviving this long and not passing out without the oxygen is, is just insane. Did this man take Herschel, then give her a map? Oh, now you're saying bring Negan. Oh, okay. He took Herschel and said bring Negan to me. Okay, so Jenny made it out of the sewer. Jenny shot the flare. And a lot of people are going to see that. Well, no Herschel this episode, but uh, two major things happen. Well, it happened in one moment, but yeah, two, two characters actually got killed. Amaya and Tommaso. We figured out Tommaso was a rat. You know, he got packed. And then Amaya, she got packed as well. Because with all the markers jumping on, he grabbed three people. Maggie could only save one. She saved Jenny. And then uh, Tommaso got bit in his neck. And, uh, excuse me, Amaya got her guts ripped out. And it looked like Maggie and um, Jenny were able to get out there. Did y'all see that walker, though? That walker looked disgusting as fuck. But um, that walker, yeah, like I said, was disgusting as hell. But it looked like Maggie and Jenny made it out the sewer. Uh, Jenny shot the flare, which uh, you probably shouldn't have shot that flare because that is like, that's letting everybody know where you are. But I get she's trying to get to Negan, you know what I'm saying? She really cares about Negan. Negan really cares about her. Um, it looked like they was doing some flash forward, flash back thing, but I, I don't know what they was doing with Jenny for that second. I don't know. Maybe I'm just slow or something. Um, overall, pretty interesting episode. I will say for sure I liked the last episode a lot more than this episode. Uh, episode four was probably one of my favorite episodes of the season. We'll have to see what this finale li uh, is like. I'm pretty sure Herschel is going to um, come back. 
and we're gonna see him hopefully i really want her to be there i don't see him being dead either right um logically he probably would be in a real life scenario possibly but then again i don't know because uh, with that trade he was like bring me negan and you'll get herschel back that's essentially and we haven't seen that you know until that moment you know what i'm saying but uh so it looked like um what was it the croat and his uh his boss slash lover i don't know looks like they want to recruit negan it didn't look like they want to kill him or capture him it looked like they kind of wanted to recruit him and so he can go back to his uh uh savior type ways you know what i'm saying I don't know. Uh, I don't see Negan uh, getting himself back into that. I'm not fucking with the Marshall. Negan's a way better man than I am. Um, nah, I can't even say that because Negan done, has done some fucked up shit. I would just say, like, Negan has a lot more of, um, what is it, remorse or, you know, compassion. Um, he just feels for the Marshall, I guess. He just want to be helpful. Because me personally, with all the Marshall has done, I would have left that man... I would have left that man when he was hanging, when the Croat threw him over the uh, ledge or whatever. And I most definitely would have left him on the motherfucking steps. Like, fuck him. But, hey, looks like the Marshall's going to be sticking around for a while. Amaya and Tommaso got packed. Mangy and Jenny made it out the sewer. She shot that flare. Negan saw it, so they'll get reunited again. We just got to see how this last episode goes. And uh, I don't mind the six episodes. And I think after this is the Daryl um uh, uh, Daryl series, so I'm excited for that. Can't wait for that Michonne and Rick series. But uh, until next time, y'all. Peace.